imagine standing in the supplement aisle or scrolling through Amazon and your eyes see rows and rows of magnesium options. From magnesium citrate to magnesium glycinate, the choices can be overwhelming. You might be asking yourself, which one is right for me? Well, I'm Dr. Kate Henry, head of medical education at Rupa Health. And in today's video, we'll embark on a journey to discuss the eight different types of magnesium. Together, we'll explore their unique benefits and help you figure out which one's right for you. So if you've ever been puzzled about picking the right magnesium, this video is for you. First up is magnesium citrate. Bound with citric acid, it's a superstar when it comes to absorption, but a heads up, it can act as a mild laxative. This can be really great if you're looking to fix constipation in addition to taking advantage of magnesium's other benefits like muscle relaxation and feeling more calm. And migraine warriors, take note, studies have shown a significant reduction in migraine headaches from magnesium citrate use. Next, we have magnesium glycinate. Paired with the amino acid glycine, this type of magnesium is not only easy to absorb, but gentler on the stomach than magnesium citrate. It doesn't really act as a laxative, but you shouldn't use this if you or a close family member has a history of bipolar disorder. It's also absorbed a little less efficiently than the other forms of magnesium. And so if you're looking to get the best bang for your buck, it might not be your best bet. Glycine can also be very calming. And so after you chat with your mental health professional, you may find that the magnesium glycine Glycinate is a more calming form of magnesium if you've got some anxiety. Magnesium chloride is up next. Whether you're taking it orally or applying it topically, it's a winner for absorption. Especially for those with fibromyalgia, this one has shown promising results in several studies. Have you ever heard of magnesium malate? Paired with malic acid, this form of magnesium is not only easily absorbed, but is also gentle on your digestion. It's even been linked to muscle pain relief. The famous magnesium sulfate, or as you may know it, Epsom salt. It's perfect for relaxing soak in the tub, but not great internally. It doesn't taste great and you shouldn't drink it. Instead, you can do something like a magnesium Epsom salt bath. You can put some Epsom salts in a bathtub, fill it and soak to ease achy muscles and to feel better after a workout. Last but not least, we've got magnesium taurate. It's magnesium paired with the amino acid taurine. It's a potential gem for blood pressure and insulin issues. Though it's not the most commonly found on the shelves or on Amazon, it's definitely worth a look. So there you have it. A whirlwind tour of the different types of magnesium. Remember, everyone's body is unique. So always consult with your healthcare professional to find the perfect form of magnesium for you. We hope you enjoyed today's video and please make sure to like and subscribe for more videos on health and wellness and to learn about the cutting edge of root cause medicine.